Welcome to Sci-Fi Wire's Who Won the Week. I'm Jackie Jennings, and this week I am joined by the host of Sci-Fi Wire's Behind the Panel and contributing editor, Mike Avila. Hello! Pleasure to be here. Thanks for having me. Such a pleasure to have you. Okay, so Mike and I had a chance to see Ant-Man and the Wasp last night, and I want to know, Mike, what did you think? I really enjoyed it. Funniest Marvel movie to date, no doubt. And the big laughs came in small packages. See? I've been practicing that one, sorry. <laughs> no, look, there are a few quantum plot holes in the film that are so big you're going to be able to drive matchbox cars through them. Don't be that guy or girl. Sit back and enjoy the film. It's a lot of fun. Yeah, I agree. And I think the best part is we finally get to see Evangeline Lilly suit up as the Wasp. And man and the Wasp teaming up. She's amazing. She's a bona fide action star. And at some point, it, it feels like this is the Wasp and Ant-Man, right? It absolutely does feel like she takes the movie over, yeah. She's also just as great with the comedy bits. And that's saying something because she's she's working alongside guys like Michael Pena, who's a standout here, and every scene he's in is laugh out loud funny. And oh yes, Baba Yaga. Baba Yaga. Baba Yaga. We won't explain it, you'll get it though. Also no loved Lawrence Fishburne as Bill Foster and Hannah John Common as Ghost, one of my favorite parts of the movie. She's incredible. Her effects for her phasing are incredible. I hope we get to see more of her in the future. And great choreography in the fight scenes with her and Evangeline Lilly. She's definitely the angriest ghost we've ever seen. Uh, I do wish we knew a bit more about her character by the end of the film. I think that's one area where the film kind of fell short in. But aside from that, it was still very entertaining. If you're wondering how this fits in with the Infinity War timeline, stick around, stay through the credits. You will definitely know by the end. That's yes. all we'll say. No spoilers, but you will know. Okay, so Mike, who won your week? Was it the Wasp or Ghost? Without a doubt, bzzz, the Wasp. But hey, tell us who won your week in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe and click that little bell down there so you don't miss any Sci-Fi Wire updates.